So for our first uh, standard, standardized patient, uh, I think it went well. Um, things that I need to do better is definitely take a better history, ask questions that, uh, that don't just apply to the injury, kind of how it applies to her life or how this is gonna affect her life kind of deal. Um, I need to, I, I definitely need to incorporate the patient more into my eval as opposed to just looking at her as a patient. Um, things that I did well, I feel like I did my special tests and my palpations really well and that really helped guide what I thought the pathology was. Um, things I didn't do again, I didn't range of motion, do I didn't test range of motion. Um, uh, it's not a huge issue because it was an MCL pathology, but it's, it should be in all, um, in all evals for documentation purposes. Another thing I didn't do was manual muscle tests, but because it was an MCL injury, I wasn't too concerned with manual muscle testing. Um, and uh, <laughs> and I, I think that... Um, the main focus, what I really need to improve on for the next um, standardized patient is making sure I'm more loose, um, more comfortable, more, seeming, making myself seem more confident. Um, I felt like I sounded a little timid, uh, even though I was confident in my abilities, I didn't seem like I was confident in my abilities, and I feel like that can affect where the patient views me as a clinician, and you want to make it sound like you know exactly what you're talking about. So. And that's a big thing that's going to be, um, that I'm going to need to improve for my next standardized patient. And uh, next one will go a little bit more smooth. Thank you.